Debbie Turner, my name is Doug Dimmadome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimmadome. Thank you for locating my long lost son, Dale Dimmadome, heir to the Dimsdale Dimmadome fortune. If there's anything I can ever do to repay you for your kindness, all you need to do is ask. Doug Dimmadome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimmadome. That's right, Doug Dimmadome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimmadome. Morning, Ephrata. My name is Chris. And I'm Carl. Today is Tuesday, May 23rd. Please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. A few extra yearbooks will be available for, for, for purchase from Mr. Bischoff in room 318, Mrs. Chinchak in room 201, or Mrs. Seipel in the attendant's office while supplies last. These will be sold on a first-come, first-served basis. A few remaining books are available at a cost of $80 with tax included. The activity bus will run this week on Tuesday, May 23rd, and Thursday, May 25th. The final day for the activity bus is Thursday, May 25th. On June 5th at 7 p.m., the annual baccalaureate service honoring the class of 2017 will be held in the high school auditorium. All are welcome to join in celebration of the graduating class. There will be a summer job fair in and around the cafe today. There will be 14 employers looking to fill positions. Remember, the interview begins when you walk in the cafe. Employers are on the following list. T Press Cafe, Brethren Village, uh, VFW, Performance Personnel, Dairy Queen, GSM Roofing, Keystone Coating, Kmart, Fairmount Homes, After the Wreck, The Dutch Made Deck, Maple Farms, Hallby's Hardware, and Hershey Entertainment. Now over to Carl with lunch. Today for lunch we have walking tacos with Spanish rice, maxi cheese sticks with sauce, uh, Papa John's pizza, ham, roast beef, cheese wrap, fruit and yogurt parfait with muffin, buffalo chicken salad, refried re beans or Tex-Mex, bean salad, Mexican corn, grape tomatoes with dip, and assorted fresh fruit or a slushy. Now over to Jory with sports. I'm living in that 21st century, doing something mean to it. Do it better than anybody you ever seen. Do it screams from the haters, got a nice ring to it. Real sports news today. We will start with NBA action. The Warriors faced off against the Spurs last night and won the series in a 4 0 sweep. Curry led all scorers with 36 points, and this was the Warriors' third straight conference championship. They will face the winner of the Cavs and the Celtics in their third straight NBA Finals appearance. The Cavs are currently up 2 1 against the Celtics, but the Celtics will try to tie the series tonight in Cleveland. Also in NBA news, the NBA draft is coming up and the debate continues. Who will go number one, Lonzo Ball or Marco Fultz? The draft is scheduled for June 22nd. In NHL action, the Predators won against, the Predators won their series and will go to the NHL Stanley Cup Finals and they will face the winner of the Penguins and the Senators. The Penguins are currently up 3-2 in the series. That's it for sports, now back to the main desk. There will be a brief meeting on Thursday, June 1st, for students taking AP Computer Science principals next year in room 320, immediately after school. Be sure to contact Mr. Myers if you are unable to attend. Attention seniors, the end of the year is approaching fast. Please try to deplete your lunch account before May 26th. If you are carrying a balance as of June 5th, you may request a refund, providing you meet the guidelines. If you are a student who has received a no-charge meal and have not repaid your debt, please do so by May 31st. Those who do not repay their debt will not be eligible to receive future no-charge meals until it is paid in full. Congratulations and best wishes the Effort High School cafeteria staff. Attention AP Lit and Comp students for the upcoming year. We will have an informational meeting today at 2.45 in room 106. 
Mrs. Grable will discuss course expectations and assign the sum of work. If you cannot attend, make sure to see Mrs. Grable. That's it for us today. Have a great day, Ephrata. Down the street, he says, Why am I soft? And